Hey everybody, it's me, Wildman Beats here, and this is going to be episode 26 of Code Vein, and it's more likely to become a death compilation uh, episode as well, as we've gotten to Ornstein and Smooth, or as they're better known in this game, Blade Dancer and Cannoneer, uh, probably one of the pinnacle fights of this game, and we are going to tough our way through it, so... Anyway, thank you for coming to watch this video. I hope you enjoy, and otherwise, let's get into it. All right, so my plan to get through this fight was using a single hand sword, but I think we're gonna go to my big, uh, big two-hander. And we're still gonna keep all these equipped. We're just gonna change this out for the triple annihilator. Um, am I missing anything? Ooh, do I have anything that gives like a fire damage barrier? I should, right? Oh God, and which one of these? Oh, it's here. I don't have it mastered. I haven't used any of those awake MJ 212s. I've got 33. I don't have any haze because I lost it to the boss. Fuck it. Let's go. <laughs> there went that. Now, I think I'm going to go into this a little more strategy. We tried it a couple times in the last episode. Um, didn't really make too much progress. I don't think. I think we got one killed and the other about halfway. Um, which, honestly, when I say it like that, that's not too bad. But um, it's not where we want to be. I think I'm just going to focus on that lady, which was the original plan. But since this is not a single player, like you've got a companion. If I keep that lady distracted, I'm getting net damage, right? Even if, if I'm doing no damage, I'm just keeping the blade lady distracted. That's net good because EO is going to do damage. So I might just like try to play ultra conservative only take hits where I really can try to keep as much HP so I can keep the aggro So that EO's putting out as much damage as possible because she's got unlimited healing, right? She can heal herself as long as she wants But mine is not So that's kind of my thought going into this Let's see if that will work only one way to know. Well, that's not a good way to start. Uh-oh. She's already aggroed to the wrong one. I died. Eo died. This is, uh, th that's a botched run. That, that, that was, we're just warming up here. Nothing to see. That did not go at all as I'd planned. For one, I can't distract her if she starts out aggroed on the wrong person, for fuck's sake. Uh, man, this game just does not work in a way that is, uh, how you want it to <laughs> Okay, get you with the poison and a trap How come you didn't come all the way you bitch? See, I, that was wild blocking. Why did you act? Oh, my God. 
Get over here. Yeah, you're mine. Where did I take all that damage from? take both I can't take both why am I taking both aggro So dumb. Dude, the cannon here. Some of them big hits. I didn't have stamina for dodge. Why is the cannoneer shit always there? I'm dead. See, I just lost a thousand HP from the cannoneer shit. Why is he hurt so much? Can I get a backstab? Isn't even worth doing without you. Can you? Thousand damage. Just like that. Ah. 
I don't want to do this anymore, man. I don't want to do it anymore. Thank you. Oh my god, why how is she having so many revives? How do we not have all these revives during the fight normally? Why did she de aggro? Well, I'm gonna just. What the fuck? God, dude, it did 2,000! You see that shit? Fifteen hundred. It actually did fifteen hundred. That's not fun amounts of damage There's no reason for that attack to do 1500 damage Okay, that time it only did a thousand again, that's cool It does over a thousand. Fifteen hundred on average. I need a different follower. We're throwing EO out on the streets, dude. That is unforgivable. Hey, here at least we're using the same weapon. I know he's gonna pack a punch just like I do. I can dodge it in time. I'm dead. I'm dead, but... You know, I'd be curious to try is, uh, inhibit. Because inhibit makes it so that enemies can't use abilities. So if she can't use any of her freeze, she's only left to, uh, she's only got her ma basic attacks left, right? And I'm out of inhibit, and it never did anything. It never did a thing. She's still using her abilities. Inhibit didn't do jack shit, man. The dumbest fucking ability. The dumbest shit. Oh. Man. God damn.
bigger motherfucker. can save him. You. Where? My partner healing ability is off? What? Ah. Get over here, little bitch. me heal me Yakuma. oh my god he didn't heal me restore his hp oh my god uh don't you love it i was in the middle of an attack i was in the middle of an attack when he hit me with the fire and I can't dodge in time. Isn't that such a cool fucking mechanic? It's so fun. It's so fun that something that does over three quarters of your HP is unavoidable if you happen to be in the middle of an attack. That's so cool. I love the, the that they designed it like that. That's so innovative, you know? No other game company really thought of such a fun mechanic. Yukumo hits now. One enemy left. The blade, blade dancer died. Get him! Get him! Get him! Get him! Get him!
We got it. We did it. It's over. The worst fight of any video game is over. The plagiarizers have been defeated. It's unbelievable. It's a Christmas miracle. <laughs> it's a little past Christmas, but. <laughs> oh my God. Oh, and the lovely mini map. Oh, you guys can't see the mini map. So the mini map, I guess I can pull it up like this. It shows where your footprints have been and they don't go away. So you can see how I walked all over this arena. Uh, <laughs> I'm a little bit delirious, but I will stand by my remarks that this fight was horrible. And this fight has also reduced my opinion of this game to like, oh my God, this game is bad. Let's see what we get though. What is Mito? Is was that his name? I already forgot. Miko. What does he think about us killing his things? He doesn't give a Stop shit. Stop right there, Mito. <sighs> Your persistence is tiring. So tell me, just what exactly are you after anyway? What do you have to gain in reviving the queen? Reviving the Queen. <laughs> What's so damn funny? I've collected enough data already. I have no more use for the Queen. Then why? Let me ask you something. Do you ever sit back and wonder why you were created in the first place? Or why revenants have power far beyond that of mere humans? That's simple. Everyone knows it was to stop the Queen when she frenzied. Aren't you forgetting something? The day of the Great Collapse? The creatures that caused all that ruin. Both Revenants and the Queen were created to eliminate those horrors. And yet, they are all still incomplete. I wanted to witness Gregorio's monstrous transformation with my own eyes, but sadly it cannot be. Oh shit, what? Now. Allow me to show you the truth of our world. What? What? They all had relics inside of them? is unlocked so those homed in on Gregorio Yep, that is exactly what they did. So now he's got three relics in him. Oh my God.
I don't like that noise. Why is he so slimy sounding? Ugh. Oh, so he turned into a three-headed lion? Interesting. felt it all the way back at home base <gasps> oh right the blood mist was held there by Gregorio so now it's gonna go away Oh, that's right. That might not be a good thing, though. Mist is fading. We can go out. We can leave. Uh oh. Yes, we're free. We can finally escape this horrible prison. We've been here so long. alive and the blood mist is back the mist isn't fading all those relics and yet somehow he still resists Stubborn fool! I'll finish you with my own hands! How can you still not understand? You all saw them too! The world outside is overrun with creatures that devour everything in their path! They will be the source of even greater strength for all revenants! Evolution is everything! It is our duty, our very hope as a species! I think you need to die, Mito. see that, the blind fool. So he created the Red Mist as a cage and sealed away all his research. He was satisfied with merely eliminating the feeble horrors within his pen, and thus foolishly halted the march of progress. But the horrors outside continued to evolve, until finally they transcended Revenants and became an existential threat. You fools noticed nothing! 
Our prison of red mist became a barricade, protecting revenants from the horrors that awaited them beyond its borders. All this time you were being shielded by Gregorio from reaching your true potential. The hypocrisy turns my stomach. But now the time has finally come for us to leave the cradle. Let us all rise and ascend the ladder of evolution together! You bastard. After all you've done, just how many more lives are you willing to sacrifice? Enough, Mito! We won't let you do this! We won't let him, no. Those who are too weak to keep up with the speed of progress do not deserve to live. What swill? We will stop you. After all they've done for everyone. The successors will not have suffered in vain. So we fight Vito now? I wasn't ready for another boss fight right after. You're kidding me. Oh my god. You're not. Ah, okay. What's he doing? Second phase? Ow! I need a revive. Oh my god. Wait, what did so much damage to me? What did so much damage to me? Holy shit. We actually got pretty close, though. I mean, let's just go do it again, I guess. pretty far oh but this haze is pretty important to get bring it any time to the fruit of my research Kumo? Oh.
I dodged, man. I dodged. I pushed dodge. What more do I need to fucking do? We're going with the big sword again. Man, if the first boss fight wasn't enough to make me quit the game oh, I'm glad they put in a second one Couldn't miss out on that chance I can't do the fight if my companion's gonna die that early on. He wasn't even taking hits, like what? Or he shouldn't have been taking hits. But I'm really wondering in that second phase, because the first phase is whatever, it's not hard. Second phase though, those little swirling balls that go over you, what do you do about them? How do you avoid them? Like you can dodge, but it's like there's no sound indicator or visual indicator when they're gonna pop. It's just completely based on feel? What? That's kind of bull. No harm in being prepared. Be reduced to ash. Changed his attacks, huh? Reviving each other. Uh oh, never mind. There went that plan. That wasn't even near me, dude. Oh my god. Okay. No, no, we're not doing this. Not today. Uh, we are gonna put this game away for a little bit. Because how did I die to that? The AoE is absurd. 
and you've got balls that detonate with no indicator that's a great strategy that's what every game has is no visual indicator for explosions man what it what were they thinking but that's where we're gonna leave it for episode 26 of code vein the disappointment edition so anyway thank you for subscribing and hitting that bell button and as always have a great day.